what it is, what it do, Cyber World. It is your girl, the one, the only, Ash Brown. And this is the Ash Said It Show, all right? Over 1,800 episodes, half a million streams, and growing. None of this is possible without you guys, so I thank you so, so very, very much. I have a a very big name with me today, okay? She's a step and repeat, and if you've been paying attention to the show the last couple of years, you will know the name C. Zeta. Yes, from Eleven Ravens. Hey, C. <laughs> hey, good afternoon, good evening. Yes. Um. <laughs> <laughs> All that good stuff. I love it. See, how are you doing? Like, where are you today? Where in the world are you? Oh, well, I'm in Los Angeles today. And, um, yeah, and most most of the time our team is in Los Angeles. Gotcha, gotcha. All right, see, so a lot of people know Eleven Ravens for designing and manufacturing just custom luxury game tables, billiards, table tennis, poker. The list goes on and on. Now, you guys have expanded into a luxury sipping tequila well, I want to talk mm-hmm. about that. See, where did the inspiration for this sipping tequila come from? Well, it came to our founder, Michael Zretzky. Um, really, it was kind of a journey. Um, mm-hmm. he, he immigrated to America in the 1980s mm. um, from Belarus, and um, he'd never had tequila before. It, it's not popular where he came from. Mm-hmm. And so when he came to the U.S., he really enjoyed it. And mm. um, kind of when he was making new friends, um, he would try different tequilas and it was something that kind of became a part of his, you know, his social life is going out, his uh, drink of choice, uh, you might say. And (laughs) actually over the last 10 years, uh, he started basically exploring Jalisco, Mexico and learning more about the drink. Um, Mm. And just, you know, I honestly have a passion for for himself and wanting to share that passion with other people and make something really beautiful. Um, Mm. So similar to our other company, Eleven Ravens, it's kind of come from a personal passion Mm -hmm. um, that ends up growing into a business. Um, And so, yeah, (laughs) Ravella was launched in uh, December of 2022, so not too long ago. And, um, yeah, there was a lot of development leading up to it. Mm -hmm. And um, right now we have an extra Añejo available, so that is a sipping tequila. Mm. Um, Yeah, I'm happy to tell you more. (laughs) (laughs) Yes, yes, we want more. Like, let's talk about the packaging. You were telling me about something really unique about the Mm -hmm. packaging. Exactly. So, um, I love Ravens and Ravella, all of the the brands that um, our our company um, manages and designs for, uh, we're really focused on innovating and creating things that are new and um, kind of the height of luxury and construction and the bottle itself. Um, everyone can check out um, our Instagram or our website, uh, Ravella Tequila.com mm. and at Ravella Tequila. And you'll see uh, the beautiful bottle. It has uh, a very kind of more masculine glass um, bottle mm. with um, a gradation from um, black to clear and um, a beautiful closure that kind of looks like the head of a raven, which is one of our inspirations um, <laughs> yeah. behind a lot of our work, um, which is a, a very mysterious, kind of you know, unique uh, bird and has um, a strength as a symbol um, mm-hmm. for uh, a lot of our designs. Um, and the, the packaging as well with the box around it, mm-hmm. it um, mimics the wings of a bird. So it opens up <laughs> as if the wings are kind of holding the bottle. And um, it's a beautiful thing. And sometimes you look at a product and you see it in the store and, you're, and you think it's beautiful. Um, mm-hmm. There's so much work that goes behind it. And mm. um, yeah, I'd love to share about our team. You know, we've we basically taken a, a few years really working on this packaging mm. and sourcing from different places with artisans around the world. So um, the closures are are made um, out of Zamak, which it's it's a very hard material, and it almost looks and feels um, once it's once it's coated and with our um, mm-hmm. gold finish, it looks and feels like actual gold. It's very heavy. Mm. It has a weight. So when you're drinking the tequila, it's not just about the liquid. Mm-hmm. Um, the liquid is very important, yeah. but the packaging and the way that you experience the attach- packaging and approach uh, mm. Ravella, um, there's a real experience of luxury and um, almost there's something kind of poetic about opening the, the box yeah. and taking the, the closure off the bottle and pouring the tequila um, in a way it could be very ceremonial or very, it feels very important. Mm-hmm. And um, we wanted uh, the client or the 
a person enjoying the tequila to have an experience while opening the box and um, pouring the tequila itself. So um, they kind of start out with that first impression that's both visually appealing and also sensory um, mm. before you even smell or taste yeah. Uh, the, yeah, the, the liquid itself. That is awesome. I love it. Now, are you guys going on tour with Vivella? Like, what's the story with that? Absolutely. So um, since we launched in uh, December of 2022, we've been selling online. And you can find us on Mm. oldtowntequila.com. So that's kind of our primary um, place right now where you can purchase. Um, We're also selling in Los Angeles. So if you are in LA and you can come in person, Mm -hmm. um, we're expanding our reach. So Right now, it's it's more exclusive. We're we're doing a lot of private events, okay. um, but we're also doing events to the public. So if you follow us on Instagram, um, you will see uh, opportunities to taste our tequila in different places. Um, a lot of times, it's art or design events or luxury events or um, a lot of really fun uh, collaborations. So I would keep an eye out for that. Mm-hmm. Um, okay. And we are speaking with some restaurants. Um, so. Okay. If you keep an eye on our Instagram and our website, you'll start to see um, a listing of websites. So we're, we're pretty fresh. We're pretty um, <laughs> uh, new, but you'll start seeing us at restaurants um, soon. And we'd say we're, we're trying to keep uh, the tequila in places where we feel like um, the flavor of the tequila and the type of um, alcohol that it is would make sense for the space. So mm-hmm. um, trying to make it kind of curated in a way, uh, gotcha. the way that we're approaching the um the sales and the marketing of of Ravella. Okay, sounding like a plan there. And uh, let everyone know again, what's the best way to purchase Ravella if they're not it in LA? On, <laughs> yeah, the best way is on oldtowntequila.com. So then you can order it. It'll come straight to your door and they ship worldwide. Um, so it's a very easy, modern way to um, have have your tequila ready for um, your parties. Or um, we also see that it's such a it's been a really popular for uh, gifts for holidays like Christmas or um, Valentine's Day, Father's Day, that kind of thing. So keep it on your radar. It's a, it's a beautiful gift. I absolutely love it. See, thank you so much for coming back on my show. I appreciate you as always. (laughs) And I appreciate each and every one of you guys. Thank you so much for all of your love and support. Keeping in mind anyone to tell you that you can't do what you want to do. You look them square in the face. You tell them, don't believe me. Just watch. Watch what I do. Watch me make it happen. Watch me make history. That's what we're doing this for, the history books. Social media is nice, but real life is so much better. Until next time, you guys.